Have you ever had a shower thought? It's very common to spend a lot of time and a lot of energy trying to solve a problem only to find a solution kind of randomly when you least expect it. This is because our minds constantly oscillate between two modes of thinking, the diffuse mode and the focused mode. Hello, and if you're new to this channel, I'm Anne-Laure, I'm a neuroscience student, and apparently I can't clip a mic. I really tried. Let's have a look at a little trick based on how your brain works that is going to help you think better. The concept of diffuse mode and focused mode of thinking, which was coined by Professor Barbara Oakley. Together, these two modes of thinking allow us to combine productivity and creativity, allowing us to get the best of both worlds. Focused thinking is when we try really hard to solve a problem. We look into the details, we do some research, and we try to explore potential solutions. As you've probably noticed from personal experience, the focused mode of thinking has a high cognitive load, which means that it requires a lot of resources from the brain and it makes it hard to maintain over a long period of time. On the other hand, the diffuse mode of thinking is when we let our mind wander, which we sometimes call daydreaming. And a typical result of such a relaxed state are shower thoughts. When you're in the shower, you feel very relaxed. You feel like you're thinking about nothing. Thing. But actually, your mind is doing a lot of work in the background, connecting ideas without you even realizing it. Both the focused mode of thinking and the diffuse mode of thinking are super important for decision making and problem solving. The only difference is that with the diffuse mode of thinking, the one that gives you shower thoughts, you're not steering the wheel. Everything is happening unconsciously. Sorry, my camera died. So is one type of thinking better than the other one? Well, the answer is no. You need both. And more precisely, you need to alternate between the two to think better. First, a little bit of focused thinking to try to really understand the problem, to try to find solutions, do your research, get into the details. And then but don't wait until your mental energy is completely depleted then go into diffuse mode of thinking, take a break, go for a walk, let your mind wander, let your brain do the work in the background. Taking conscious breaks so you can make the most of the diffuse mode of thinking is one of the best things you can do when it comes to decision making and problem solving. After you're done with your break, go back to focused mode of thinking. Try to solve the problem again and you will see that after you've let your brain work in the background on the problem, it will be much more easier to solve. And sometimes the best thing is that you don't even need to wait until you get back into focused mode of thinking to find the solution. Again, these are the shower thoughts, the aha moment, the eureka, where the solution comes to you seemingly out of nowhere. Being able to switch between focused mode of thinking and diffuse mode of thinking is one of the easiest tricks that you can start applying today to think better. Let me know if you give it a try. And if you found this video interesting, please make sure to subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Squishy, squishy. Hey.